Hello, J2.0 here, back playing Hearts of Iron 4 with uh, Mongolia. I was just looking at Europe, seeing how it's uh, changed, and uh, look at Austria. I mean, they start out with a tiny little section here, and now look at them, they're massive. Really, really changed. Uh, I think they've got Hungary and someone else here, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, huge, massive. Is that Bulgaria? That's weird, isn't it? Oh, it's like a space. Serbia's doing all right against uh, Bulgaria there. Not too bad, huh? Hey? So, so ah, okay, yeah. Uh, can't really see anything else that's changed. No, don't don't really seem like much else has. Ah, yeah. Look at that. What's that then? That's weird, isn't it? Colony state. <laughs> Pacific States of America. Yeah. And then for some reason there's uh, nobody there. Weird. Some there as well, look. Just, just no, nobody there. Huh. I wonder if you can colonize it. Anyway, let's get back to uh, to me. Look at that, massive. I remember when we were fighting down here. We've, we've come a long way. <laughs> right. Uh, oh yeah. We're not. We're not going to do that. We'll just uh, crack on. 1942 beautiful loving it i am loving it yes yes we're gonna have our tanks we're gonna have our cavalry we're doing all right guys we are doing all right let's just hope it don't do all the same events that it usually does that pop up every time we're gonna send them three over there oh they actually pushed out weird uh send to yeah I'll send you there you can stay there okay hey oh, tank division there heavy heavy tank uh, you can go in there oh, where are they going what are you doing down there what Honestly, hey, oh, uh, unfulfilled imp, uh, exports. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. Okay. Oh God, my eyes. I was cutting onions earlier. Still, still watering a little bit. Uh, we will push. We'll use you two. There we go. Buzzing. Push you up there. Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll win that one, won't we? Militia versus uh, cavalry, no problem. Five divisions there. Push you guys in there. Nice. Sweet. Akuma Matatas. It means no worries. Oh, oh, ah! Oh shit. Uh, fuck. Going there, going there. Quick, quick man, help, help. What are you doing? It's out there. We must win this battle. Nine versus five. I think their technology is starting to overrate ours. We're not doing too bad though. Uh, Cool. Awesome. Uh, yeah, do that one. How are they doing? They've lost. Wow. We've lost a lot more than them. Hmm. Combined. 61, 6, 49. Only six divisions. Oh, we have more than that. Ah, no, no, no. Because they've lent us theirs, haven't they? So. Sweet. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. I know it's a bit early, but we'll bring them into service anyhow. Uh, we will put them all on this front line. <coughs> we will actually. Ah, 
yes, okay. Wow, we've got a long way to go to Moscow. But I want to push to there. We'll do this. What we insufficient resources? Two oil. Damn. Hmm. <laughs> Albania versus Arabia. That's a weird mix, isn't it? Who can we buy oil off? Uh, can't buy it off Soviet Union. Is anyone near us? Burma. How's our factories going? We'll build a few more. Wow. Look at that. It's just, I think that is Mongolia itself. Is that right? Right, now we've got that, we'll build two more military factories and uh, synthetic oil buzzing. Nice, <laughs> cool. We're running low, we're already running out. I mean, that was in its 300,000, something like that, and now it's 264. Okay, guys, let's make a big old push. Let's use one of you guys there, and you can go there. You guys can go there, you go there, go in there. Ooh, hoo, hoo. interesting. Hey, up, hey, up. Uh, the Second Weltkrieg. The Weltkrieg is universally agreed to have been the most horrible war in human his existence, but it appears that even the greatest nightmares cannot deter man's lust for blood. After numerous political struggles and periods of diplomatic tension, the uneasy peace between Germany and France has broken down. These two superpowers are now mobilising their armies and preparing for a conflict never before seen to human eye. The military developments of the interwar will be put to the ultimate test. New types of weapons, planes, artillery, ships and tanks will see their first usage in the battlefield. But who will emerge victorious? This is a question none can answer. War is hell. Wow, interesting. Very interesting. Huh, hey look, even the uh, Swiss Confederation has lost a bit of land. I think that should be Swiss there, shouldn't it? It's a very weird map. Hmm. Hmm. Germany's gonna smash them though, aren't they? I mean, come on. Commune of France. What's going down here? Why why are they sending units over there? Do we really need units here? Come on, this is why. Someone said uh, on a comment section to give Tibet more land. Well, this is a perfect example of why you don't trust the AI with stuff. It's all quiet on the eastern front. <laughs> wink, wink, cough, cough. Wow, we've almost pushed it. I wonder if we can split it in half. That might be a good idea. Huh. I wonder where all my... Uh, Tanks have gone. There they are. Where you at? Where you at? Can't, oh, up here. Okay. Uh, sure. Let's make a big old push. Why the hell not? Oh, it's paused. No wonder. Here, is it? It's just not working. <clears throat> Sweet. Cool. Come on, they can't. It's five against one. Well, once that armor goes in, I reckon it'll be right up. I reckon we'll, we won't do too bad. Where are they going? 
House there, factory is that? Yeah. Huh, nice. Uh yeah, we'll send you two there. I mean three, sorry. Hey oh, are they uh, attacking? I believe they are. Alright. And you're attacking there, fine. They're pushing on all the fronts, sire. What shall we do? Shut up, you fucking bitch. Fight. I don't know why I said that, to be honest. <laughs> I have no re clue. Hmm. We've almost pushed where we want to be here. And... Uh, we're getting closer to our objective. Oh, hey, oh, hey, oh. The Flemish, we'll oh, pause this set. The Flemish Wallonian government has gone into exile and their main forces have capitulated to Commune of France, who is now in control of their home area. The struggles between Commune of France and Flanders Wallonia was only a small part of the conflict. The war between the th uh, between Third International and what remains of Middle Europa continues, else continues elsewhere. Is that down here? Uh, okay. Look how big they are. Shit. Are they fighting them? They are in the entity, which is Ireland Australasian. Whoa. I did, I've not even checked down here, have I? Wow. So they're. That's one whole. That's like a whole nation. Hmm. <laughs> And they're sharing the island. Hmm. Cool. Different. It's weird that they're fighting Flanders. Ah, okay, it's because they're allied with Germany. I get it. Look at that. Wilhelm III, he looks well weird. They've updated the pictures recently, I guess. Strange. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're pushing a little bit here, aren't they? No bother. Uh, they're doing all right. Hopefully, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Forty-eight, forty-nine. 50. All right, we're doing okay. Cool. Push up with you there. You can go there. Once they finish attacking there, we'll push the horse into there. Them troops can help there. Fish better boom. Nice. That one big old land. Wow. <laughs> Might as well push up a little bit. All right. A little bit nerve uh, scary that there's a horse, a cavalry unit on the front line defending. Uh, whoa, sugar. Okay, maybe call off the attack. Who's gonna? Hmm. Sugar. 
Yeah, that wasn't the best idea. But we'll push here. Cool. Why not put a bit of pressure on the east? Hey up. Oh. Hey up, oh, hey up, oh, what's this? The Arab Congress, the Arab revolt in the Weltkrieg was a failure, mostly due to the defeat of the Entente and the millions of Arabs living in the Levant and Iraq stayed under Ottoman rule. Despite this though, Arab nationalism has been on the rise for many years and it has finally uh, culminated in the beginning of the Arab Congress in Cairo. Representatives from numerous Arab nations were greeted with... Sorry, I've just lost my place. Where, where was I? Oh, greeted with a spectacular performance by Egyptian dancers and an artillery salute, and the negotiations began. Experts predict that Egypt and Hashemite Arabia will lead the Congress, a Congress where bitterness towards the Ottomans and sometimes even discussions of a united Arab axes against the Turks can flow freely. I wondered where I've seen this before. <laughs> okay, it should be interesting. What's this down here? <laughs> Fair enough. So, hey, oh, uh, something's not right here. Have that is that broken free? <laughs> Seems different. I'm sure Kurdistan were fighting Ottomans a minute ago, a uh, couple of episodes ago. Hmm. <clears throat> huh. Cool. Wow, they've got a big old uh, alliance there, aren't they? Huh. Right. Cool. Princely Federation. I just can't get over how big we are now. Hmm. Within a couple of years, we've become a superpower. Smash them on the Western Front. Oh, shit. oh wow. Uh, you can go there. You attack there. Let's keep pushing them all up, I guess. Why not if they're going to leave the land? Uh, I wonder if they're doing a, a sort of scorched earth project. Hmm, interesting. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Pull you down, put you there. Excavation, cool. Nice, plus 20 Map, uh, factory output. Can't complain with that, no sir. We'll do. Uh... Huh. Army gain, defense, division recovery rate, supply consumption. <laughs> Hmm. We'll do recovery rate for now. Low manpower. What? Got half quarter of a million still. Not too bad. Right, so is it mutually exclusive? Yeah. Ooh. I think I'll go for this one. I don't know. I'll leave that for now. We've got some decent stuff there. Um, could do with getting playing soon, I think. What about infantry weapons? I'll do that one first, and then we'll do the other one. Oh, we got two. Cool. Let's 
Sweet. What are we doing with these? Oh, ho, ho, ho. nice. Sweet. Uh, we'll send. Where are these? Ah, sugar. Right, well, we'll. Damn. Kind of hoping I didn't have to do that, but. Much of these. Right, we'll send you down here, because I want to push down here. 30 divisions, not too bad. Not too bad indeed. I hope, I hope, I hope. Yeah, we're not doing too bad, look. I mean, you know, hopefully by one episode we'll push in there. Uh, Stay there. Wow, four four units there. Huh. Hey up. Cool. Wow, sure they have a lot of units there. Ay ay ay. And you can go there, attack there, help them. Cool, just what we needed. Huh. Is it winter or something, or what's going on? All oh, right, Konev. But it's getting Sternberg. Sternberg should be kicking ass. The glorious Sternberg. Too bad, not doing too bad. A little bit of extra push, That's all we need. Hey, oh, Kingdom of Siam has ca capitulated. Uh, Siamese government has gone into exile. Okay, D the Jing Dynasty. Oh man, they are getting pretty powerful, and they are our neighbours, and <laughs> we're not, they're not too happy with us, probably because we own most of their land, definitely got to watch out for them, and they are allied with pretty much, well they're allied with Germany, that's for sure, that's not good, I'm going to take them too eventually, are they not allied with anyone? Good, good, good. Cool. This is good. See a few reds though. Ah, they're holding out. That's good. Nah, give it up. Get up. Give up. It's not gonna work. Uh, who's pushing back here? We got two. Okay, it's weird. Oh fuck. Mm. 
Yeah, we'll push them in, make sure we defend there. Pushes, push them in there, that there. What the hell are they doing? Oh, jeez. I just sent them on attack. It's like loads of minuses then. Yes. Ha ha ha. Okay, hold on. Because look, you can see terrain, night. There we go. Go. the terrain light woods ah, okay and it's freezing Ooh, no wonder they're doing all right there Siberia isn't it we've we've pushed them so far up that it's only a cat fit or get through because if you know if this were lower it'd be like the name would be all along here yeah? but yeah what's this nice fantastic fantastic you can go on this this one here. Uh, no, you you fight your own battle. Thank you. bad at all. What? What does this mean? Uh, yeah, we'll do. Do the cavalry, I guess. at the objective. Wow. <laughs> Mongolia. Mongolia. Yes. Wow. Okay, uh push you on to this front here. you up to this front here where are you going okay help help there we go them kill them all ah shit Fuck. here we go nice even if we lose there they'll lose there yes there we go we're done we're good So, oh, sugar. They're actually pushing them back on this side. Oh my god, they've got no. Look at it, look how small their units are. Their strength is tiny. Ugh, no wonder they're being beat. Luckily, we're pushing them on this side. We might be able to flank around before Turk's Dan can it uh, crumbles. I might even have to push some troops into Turk's Dan. Oh, I just don't have enough units to do that, really. Um, what have we got here? Huh. I 
Right, we're not doing too bad. I think I'll uh, I'll leave this episode here. Yeah. Ooh, you know. What's this there? Ah, oh, okay, they're defending there. So we'll push. You there. Jobs are good in. They are attacking there, so we'll push them and help. They'll get defeated pretty soon. Uh, push you in. And you there too. Nice. Yeah, so so far so good, I think. Yeah, pretty pretty well. Um, let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, what, what else, you know. Yeah, I should take these over. Alash order, autonomy or whatever. Should I send some troops into Turkestan Kinet to help here? Or do you think I'll be able to push here fast enough? You know, that's kind of a... You know, a, the, the thing I've got to think about. Can I push west fast enough before they capitulate down here? Because it's not looking good there, is it really? Maybe I should have taken over their units and sorted it out, but... Mm. Yeah, so, not just, not too bad, really. Um, yeah, let me know what you think in comments. Um, and, uh, you know, should I push up north, even though every time I'm fighting there, they're winning because it's frozen. Look at that, I mean, blizzard, very cold. I'm, it's minus, a minus 100 for carrier traffic. Uh, air accident, oh, that's all air accident. Organization regain, there we go. That's one. Winter attrition, division speed, division attack. Fighting up north is seemingly like a bad bad idea. Push just to push west really should should be my aim. But if I can you know, split them in two, then the Soviet Union is gonna be very weak because whichever side I'm gonna guess this side is where they receive uh, supplies so if I cut this in half then every soldier here surely he's not going to get as many supplies I mean they must have supply bases here but the land isn't as you know it's frozen let's just say it's frozen look mountain frozen uh, yeah mountain what's that plains but it's frozen December as well, isn't it? Maybe in uh, in the summer this all changes. I'm not sure. But any soldier on this side will surely struggle compared to. Oh, okay. Oh, it's all wow! I like how it changes in the summer. I mean, in the winter and summer. Yeah. How about if we go down south? Let's see. Oh wow! Cool jungle. Yeah, so they don't suffer any problems. But it is very hot. Anyway, I do appreciate it if you stuck around to the end. Um, yeah, leave me a comment if you're new, subscribe. And, you know, the typical YouTube thing. Uh, yeah, and as always, I appreciate your support. Thank you very much. Take it easy now. Bye.